Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, J2 Cold, and today, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Look, y'all, I got a very special video for y'all today, man. You know what I'm saying? Listen, bro, grilling, you know what I'm saying? Costello, you know what I'm saying? I seen a few people reacting to this, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, why not? Why not? I gotta do it myself, I gotta react to it. I ain't watch. You know what? I have seen a little bit of the video, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna keep keep it a stat with you. So we're gonna dive right into this. I'm gonna get my opinion on it and everything, man. If you knew, you already know what to do, baby. You know what I'm saying? And as we do, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna hop straight into this video, man. We ain't even gonna waste no time, baby. What the fuck? Let's hop straight into this video, man. Cause I listen. When I was watching this though, like literally, bro. <laughs> and I fuck with this man. He's just, he's just extremely honest. And I fuck with that. Like, you could be extremely honest, you know what I'm saying, and still get the girl. He don't give a fuck about the girl. Listen, fellas, listen. This is a, this is an important lesson. You know what I'm saying? What he's about to teach. What he's showing you is literally probably something very important you're gonna learn in your life. You know what I'm saying? So listen, when doing this shit, bro. All you have to do is be yourself, bro. He gonna teach you a few points and then he gonna say a few things in his life. Nigga, be yourself. Love yourself. Nigga, get your body right. Be confident in yourself, man. The only way you gonna be confident in yourself is if you yourself put in the work and the grind and the time, nigga. And that's facts. Facts. We gonna hop straight into this, man. You already know what's going on. So back in the day, yeah. Let's say I've seen like a few things. I had a few things on rotation, yeah. What I do, I see one in the morning, yeah. So like let's say not in the morning, like twelve o'clock, lunchtime, yeah. She come through, yeah. Then five then she'd go home around five o'clock, I got my next thing. Five o'clock one would leave around nine, yeah? And then I get my next thing come through around twelve. Yes, oh, you're sir. Yeah? Actually disgusting. Around twelve, yeah. And then in the morning I'd say like you're How is he disgusting? I we only twenty seconds in. How is he disgusting? The fuck? <laughs> I gotta go, go work. Them times I need Yeah, dog, Let's not act like you 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 might not have had a lit. Maybe, well, maybe she has. I know some females, you know what I'm saying, that literally have a schedule of dudes. You know what I'm saying? Maybe she don't. But I feel like she has. I feel like you, you definitely maybe fuck more than one or two niggas in a week. In a week. Maybe not that same day, but during that week, you probably got piped three times. He just so happened to do that shit <laughs> all in the same <laughs> That's that nigga! Oh my lord. DMs, dating apps, I don't have time for that. I don't believe you should kiss a lot of frogs to find your prince. I believe in grilling them. I'm gonna be going on a series of dates to find who no, will that's, really wow me. No, that's hilarious. This is grilling. Let's get it. Big man singer is Castillo, bruv, aka the sniper, aka the main event, bruv. Big man singer, I've seen a few people in the comments asking for me to come, bruv. So, man's come through, bruv, you get me? I'm gonna be grilling her. She ain't gonna be grilling me. You Facts. Get me, bruv. Nah, bruv, Facts. I'm not worried about nothing, you get me? There's nothing she could ask me. There's nothing she could ask me that I ain't heard before. Caught cheating too many times to get stuff out here, bruv. Are you looking for a relationship, then? Sniper out now on all digital platforms, bruv. <laughs> No, that's funny. Go crazy, go crazy. Now listen, this is this is a pretty nice looking female, man. She she look cool. I've seen grilling before. If she just didn't ask like certain things during this date, man, like I don't know. I feel like some of these questions they're not regular questions you just ask during the fucking date. Like, what the fuck? Like Half this shit is like, damn, would I even, I would never even ask that. I would, a lot of this shit I wouldn't even ask till later on. Like, Yo, what the about? fuck? Hello. No, nice like to meet you. Hey, don't know, don't know. Yeah. You look nice. Thank you. Uh. Hey, thank you, Shen. What's your name? Castillo. What's your name? Castillo. Yo, the mixed race girl named The there. sniper nice. god. Okay. You know. Yo, she's kind of crisp still, you get me? Nice little light skin ting, curly hair. You get me? She's a slim ting, you get me? But... One, two, three stone, it's perfect, bruv, but I could feed her, you get me? What in the ghetto is going on? That's crazy. It oh. took you a while to get here. Where have you been? 
What? You wasn't pussy this morning and last night. Don't know. No lie. So you've had sex with someone and came straight here? Yeah. Have you cleaned your teeth? Yeah, of course. Can't be walking out of fresh pussy on my breath. That's rude, you know. We ain't there yet, you get me? We're not yeah, on we're that not level there yet. yet. Yeah, the whole funny thing is, to me, like when he said this, he kissed her. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, he kissed her! Nigga, he... he no, so, what the fuck is you talking about? Do you eat pussy, bro? Because if you ate pussy and you had sex last night, I feel like you was drunk somewhere in there and you ate pussy. You ate the you ate pussy. Maybe, 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 maybe not. I don't know. Depending on your shot. Yeah, I don't know. The woman. I did you know. actually? I, I don't know yeah, what he liked. for real. Bother you. Bothers me a bit. Why though? You could have taken one, two willies last night. You get me? It's not my business. If this is what I'm saying. This is why it's scary and this is why I don't like dating. Facts. I just feel like everyone's just moving mad. Don't worry though, I'm, I'm fully drained right now, so you know it's a genuine thing right now. I'm actually trying to get to know you. You get me? Why are you wearing glasses? Huh? Because it's like the window to the soul, innit? You ain't ready yeah, for that yet. Yeah, I'm ready though. You ain't ready yet. I'm not, you don't think I'm ready? No, 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 not yet. Do you underestimate me? Well, nah, no underestimation. I don't know if you're confident though, because I feel like you're hiding. You know, I'm here though. Are you insecure? Nah. Baby, we always confident, what? Nigga, these shades. You don't even know what these shades doing to me. My power level just went up tenfold just because of these shades. Like, the fuck is you talking about? Nigga, you know what it's under here? Nigga, if I take these off, I'm going to turn you to my dude. I to stone, nigga. Nigga, you're going to fall in love. You're going to look into my look into my eye. Like, come on. <laughs> like, what are you talking about? These shades just gave me a level up. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? If I take them off, it's even better. That's the crazy part. Like, I'm very confident. How they leveled me up, but I take them off, I'm even more powerful. Like, come on, bro. You sure? You know what I noticed here? I was in the bathroom, you was changing there. You had some knickers on the floor, so skid mark in there. You're moving mad. <laughs> what the fuck? You're moving mad. What the fuck? Did he say knickers? Like, 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 he seen her panties? Nah. That's funny, I'm not wearing knickers. So you just got your pussy nah. just out here, like, There's wearing no jeans? knickers in there. Yeah, free, why not? Wait, okay. wait, wait! So skid mark in there, you're moving mad. <laughs> you're moving mad. That's funny, I'm not wearing knickers. So you just got your pussy nah. just out here, like, There's wearing no jeans? There's knickers in there. Yeah, free, why not? How come? Why not? Because what if, like, you bend down and bare people can see your ass cracking that? There's a classy way to bend down. You bend down and you do like that. Mm. Yeah, she is. Like she's not. Car, she's this. not. That's ah, crazy. I see, right? I see. Like a lady. That's crazy. Like, so, she's not. Yourself? And the crazy part is she's really not. She's really not. Like, you couldn't tell. Like, it's like... Damn, like why? Why though? I don't know. <laughs> why? <laughs> you just out here walking with no underwear on, letting that thing just. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> letting that monkey breathe. <laughs> I do events, I do music, I do all kinds of things. Uh, Big thing, social funny. media, big man thing. Follow me on the gram if you ain't. That shit's funny, yeah. bro. What'd you do? Would you ever do OnlyFans? No. Never. No, I never say never. Because yeah. you never know like your life circumstance. What are you trying to say life circumstance? Like you got to be a struggling bitch or something? I know women that, you know, secure the bag and make a lot of money on it. Just Don't for me know. personally, I think the direction that people think OnlyFans is like sexual content, mm. it's giving it a bad name, if that makes sense. Yeah, I get you, I get you. What about you? Have you got OnlyFans? Well, I, I mean, that makes OnlyFans, sense. You know? yeah. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, that I makes sense. Like, I mean, best sex tapes and that. I feel like people need to see that shit. Oh, really? Yeah. You know the ones where you just know you're good at some shit? Are you and sure then other though? people gotta see that. How do you know you're good? I can bust on command. Really? So like, you come to... quick? Nah, like I bust on command, like I'm telling you, I can be. But... No. No, he built different. Bust on command is crazy. Nigga, I try not. To... Nigga, I be trying. How do you bust on command? Nigga, I be. In order for me not to bust, I gotta be like. A lot of the time, like not, like I could do it regular, but like if I, if you want me to go hours and hours, because I can go hours, the longest I ever went was eight hours. Believe it or not, crazy. I was off the lid. I got to be drunk. You know what I'm saying? I might have to be faded. Like, it just, it is what Three it hours. is. Things is ready to come, I come. You got to control your shit. You get me? Men's oosic. Uh, Y'all know what I'm talking about though, right? Like, when you get drunk, it's like it give you... So you get super stamina just off drinking and whatever else you might do. You know what I'm talking about? Look out there, you get me? Different level. And that's the problem because the male ego will have you thinking you're good in bed and... Do you know how I know? Because my willy drives get out crazy. 
They always come back. You got toxic dick then. Big man thing. The That's the one dick. you need right there, lad. You got girl. They'll pay your rent for that dick. Really? Big they man pay thing. Your rent. Yeah, real talk. Really? I had girl paying my rent flex. before. No, I don't know sugar mama things. Things my age. Paying your rent. Big man thing. This dick will have your girl taking out loans. Yeah, putting things in people's names. Bruv, it's mad. How much you weigh? You think? I don't know. You know. Like you're a skinny thing, innit? So like, literally, you're big things. Like when you get them on the floor, lie down flat like that. Yeah, you get the legs, stretch it all the way back. Yeah. I'm just pressing up, just got the just driving in. Oh Truly. my god! Easy way to make a gal squat. Or you do the next thing, you go on top of her, put her feet right there while you're on top of her. While you're f***ing, you get your thumb, rub on the quick way for her to bust. Joe, sometimes when it's so yeah. bad, you will like fake it so it ends. No, no, you could feel it. You hear the thing, you hear the. Oh. You know about that little <laughs> suction thing, innit? See, that's why you're smiling. You know about it. Big man thing, that's why you're smiling. Don't know. See, toast to hey. that. Don't know. <laughs> get me. So like, what do you actually look for in a woman then? Number one, I'm not gonna lie, I'm an appearance person first. You've got to look the part. Body, face, back off, all of that, yeah? I need to be like, wow, every time I look at you. That's not a bad, I don't feel like that's a bad way to go about it because, and, and, and I don't think a lot of people understand, like some people might think that's wrong, like going off of appearance and shit like that, but how, nigga? That's the first thing you, nigga, that's the first thing you look at, nigga. The fuck are you talking, like, what are you, what are we talking about? Because if you weren't attract, if you don't, if you, if they don't catch you appearance-wise, if you see what they got on, they face, whatever, whatever it might be, then what really caught you? Because you wouldn't date, you wouldn't date a big nigga. Some of y'all. Like, like, I don't know, like, 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 honestly, y'all wouldn't date a big nigga unless it was fucking Rod Wave. And y'all just going after that nigga because he can sing and got money. Like, that's it. So, don't cap. Don't cap about that. But I, I feel, I feel this point. I feel like, okay, yeah, first looks. After looks, after the looks is out the way, though, the personality shit, for me at least, you got kick in, kick in. No way in the fuck in Jose. Am... I gonna be with a female that's not gonna match the energy of my energy and the energy that I'm looking for. So when I say that, I mean like I don't want no bougie ass, bunky ass bitch. You know what I'm saying? I like I like a female that talk nice. You know what I'm saying? We nice. You know, like my girl. My girl is amazing. She is amazing. The most amazing female, bro. She really is. Like real talk. She's perfect for me. You know what I'm saying? She's she's like she's so kind. She's so beautiful, you know what I'm saying? She know how to dress, like, it's, it's, it's things that go into this shit, man, like. Next thing is. I, you, I, but back to my main point, I agree with he, I, I agree with what with, with he's saying. You gotta be secure within yourself and be able to be by yourself. Facts. You your own company. You don't need bad people around you. You don't need to be going out. You don't need no validation to feel good. You're good in your own company. I like that. Facts, and that's, a, that's, that's the third thing, too. Is the personality and are you secure within yourself? That's yeah. facts. So what's the loudest thing you've done in bed? There was this thing on my Facebook. I went to like a yardie rave. She recognized me, came up to me. We just started lips in right there in the rave, innit? And then after that, I'm not sure who this guy was. I think this must have been her baby father or something, innit? But she was with her brethren. I got in the car, her baby father was driving. Her brethren got in the front and me and her were sitting in the back. He drove us to her yard Don't and he left because they're having an argument, yeah? Play me and her f the same night, but while we were and her brethren was in the corner. Camera just filmed. <laughs> Real talk. Wait, so he knew? What the know. fuck? Was doing, bro, but it was mad. If that was the other way around, that would be a revenge porn situation. Facts. That's messed up. Yeah, I nah. Like that's what abused, bro. It's a bit mad. Nah. And motherfuckers is weird, bro. Nigga in the corner like these. Say T. Wait, 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 wait. What's the meme? Say T, little nigga. I got you right where I want you. Say T. Nigga. <laughs> nah, that's funny. That's funny. That's creep though, like, nigga, you don't got my consent, nigga. What? Yeah, because they were nah, filming crazy. me, bro. they didn't have my consent. Big man thing, yeah, when I got filmed, it wasn't a thing, but man them, don't be filming gal in that, bruv. You no. get me, bruv. You end up on a register, bruv. Like, up in there with R. Kells eating pot noodle, bruv. Don't do it. Do women ever say any stories about you? Nah, never, bruv. <laughs> nah, that nigga said you're going to end up on the register, bruv, eating pot noodles. Gonna end up on the register, bruv, eating pot noodles. 
No, don't do that thing right there. Do not do that thing. So I'm not a rapist, bro. I feel that's that. a bit mad. I'm glad you know what yeah, yeah, consent is. You got so. to, you know, like literally, some man is mad persistent with it, bro. Yeah. You got to relax, so bro. You can read the room. Yeah, big man saying you got to read the room. You're you trying to end up like okay, okay always. Now he's in jail. Always got to read the room. Give up his bar to you, bro. You just say it so normally about this like violation thing. But as women, this would be very traumatic for us. No, I'm not traumatized, bro. I'm kind of glad. My, work, my work was amazing, though. It's, so it's not traumatizing. It's just the fact that they filmed that shit. I kind of want them to send that back. Why do you feel it's good video? I want to say I can improve. Yeah, low key because you know the ones there. Like, I, she was like a thick thing as well, innit? So like, I was putting in some good work. Really? So you do you like me? people watching you? If we're filming, then yeah. But I don't want nobody watching me. Like, if I was like somebody's gal and I wouldn't want him in the corner of the room, like playing with his dick and that. That would weird me out. Yeah. Do you like people to watch you? No. You don't like performing. So you never filmed your thing. You, I know you filmed your thing. No. Come on. I know you filmed your thing. Never. You know you filmed your thing, lad. You know you filmed your thing. You're pretty. I know you filmed your thing. I don't know. I say it. That's cap. That's cap. Everybody has at least once. At least once. At least once. She's sitting here. She she capping. She's capping. Sir cap a lot. There's no way. There's no way. You know what I'm saying? A lot of y'all. A lot of y'all. Why do y'all like? Why do y'all cap? Like no, I'm never. No, I don't know. No. Come on, bro. Keep it real, bro. Like, keep it real. He keeping it all the way real. He uh, he keeping it all the way official. You know what I'm saying? If 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 he going if you if he gonna do it for you, do it for him. There's no way. There's no way. Drinking the drink. That's your little key right there, isn't it? Anytime I say some shit, nah. you drink it like that. <laughs> she funny though. She funny though. Facebook. Something must have hollered at me on there. I met up with her, I went to see her. She drove, I don't know where the fuck she lived. It was so deep in north, I don't know where the f it was. It's like Pinner, bruv. Those out of the ends, hills have eyes places, bruv. So we went to her yard, we f and as soon as we finished, she started smoking crack, bruv. What? Yeah, she started smoking crack. So you slept with a crackhead? Go! 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 Whoa! Nah, fam. Nah, fam. You fucking way too much, bro. You fuck. He, my dog fucking way too much. <laughs> this is this is a story you don't tell. Why are you telling this to her? You fuck the crackhead. Nah, fuck that. Some you gotta take that to the grave, bro. Some shit you just gotta take to the grave, bro. You can't just be out here like, yeah, I fuck the crackhead, like. But I guess that's the perks of really not giving a fuck. I guess. I guess. Like, like if you were, I guess if when you when, you know when you a real nigga, you don't give a fuck. So, I mean, I guess that could be, you know what I'm saying? I guess, you feel me? But like, crackhead is crazy. Basically. And then after that, I just wanted to go to my yard, bruv. I made up a, a lie. I said my mom was cooking dinner, bruv. I gotta get home fast. Oh my God. And then she was driving home, bruv. She was swerving in the road like, oh my God, you're so beautiful. I was like, bitch, you are a crackhead, bruv. Take me home. Yeah, it's a crackhead. Like, I didn't know she was a crackhead at the time, but the pussy was good, you get me? But you look like you're like bad man. So, crackhead cool is good. I don't even want to know, son. Right. You're like you're I'm like good, man, so just grab you by the throat. I'm good, bro. Your thing. I'm not gonna lie. Out of ends, in the ends, yeah, where you from? Uh, yeah, yeah. You like the bad man in it. Uh, I can tell you like a bad man. Guys, you want me to like a bad man? I feel like you do. I fuck you up though. I'd mash you up. But I just need to know what your level is. I swear, all we're talking about is sex. Like sex, 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 sex. I swear to God, so you never just, had a I swear you just asked him a question, but okay. Somebody bear back. I know you hey, bear if back it's before. my man. You ever got STI before? No. So you never had chlamydia? No. I caught it like four times in the past. Really? That was just too many gal. The amount of times he has sex, I'm not surprised he's had chlamydia. 16 gal just juggling them around, innit? Like what? I had things from Birmingham, oh things God. from like East, North, West, all them things there. And I was just moving mad. But I had like about five proper things and some other ones that I was just in it. I feel like you've got ego, so you would want me to come. So you've... Or do you not care about women's orgasm? No, no, you gotta go first all See? the time. Facts. You gotta bust first all you the time. You gotta go first. That's just facts. I feel like if you're not, if you're not letting her go first, what are you doing? I know it's hard sometimes, Virgin. I know it's hard sometimes. Facts, <laughs> but it, you know, it's not. It's not an ego thing. It's just. That's what I want you to do, and then maybe I'll go. Maybe I'll go. To me, you know, it's more satisfying letting her than actually me. And that's—I know it sounds crazy, unless 
you doing that little thing I like with your mouth. Then then that's a whole different thing, but the time otherwise I ain't doing my shit properly. And we can that's mad. to that. I'm See, close. a man actually lets a woman come first. We'll talk. Do you know why? Yeah, because I need them repeat customers, you get me? Just, I need you, just you to nice customers. I need women. them repeat customers, because I need you to get this dick so good you go tell your brethren. So then when this shit fks up, I can get one of your brethren. Damn. No, nah, that's crazy. Do you suffer with mental health? Depression um, in that. I feel yeah. like, to be fair, I've been depressed for a long time. It's social media that saved my life. Yeah, I was going for a shit time. Yeah, I made one social media video, went viral. That should change my life. Really? But to be fair, the cure to depression is to figuring out the root of it. My root was being broke. Yeah. I figured out the root of it and then that's it. But along the way, I had to learn a lot of shit about myself. What did you learn about yourself? Like you learn your resilience. You learn how strong you are. You learn how to stretch peas. You learn to be shitted on and be able to come back from that. You know how to fall down seven times and stand up eight times. You learn all of that. You get me? You learn that, that rejection, all of that shit is nothing. Rejection is normal. Failing is normal. Yeah, it is. You know what I'm trying to say? Like, I got to give a shout out to the people, which is like followers on Instagram. People say that don't mean nothing. But for me, them people changed my life. Like 100%, them people lifted me out of all that shit. You get yeah, me? Because yeah. if they didn't help me, I'd be on a mad thing because I was this close to murking people, bro. I used to sit on night buses all day. I'd sit on night buses in the night so I wouldn't go insane. To yeah. keep my peace of mind. Do you know what I'm trying to say? And like, if anybody owed me money yeah. or nothing, I would probably do the worst to you. Do you know what I'm trying to say? A few times I try to set people up just because they try to do something bad to me. It's not a joke thing. This depression thing, it'll make you yeah. find depths of yourselves that you've never ever found in your life. You know what I'm trying to say? And when you come out from that though, you become a better person. There's nothing wrong with being in the shit, bruv. Yeah. Everybody got to lose their mind once. Because then when you find yourself, it's a madness, bruv. It's beautiful. Damn. You get me? That's why I'm happy all the time now, bruv. Life is beautiful. I like that. Cheers to you. Done now. And he's right. He's absolutely right about that. Hey, listen, man. Those who are going through depression, depression is something crazy, bro. Depression is crazy. And he's absolutely right about that, most definitely. You know what I'm saying? It'll put you in a place that's that's crazy. And when you come out of that shit, bro, bro, life is beautiful. And I say that all the time. Life is beautiful, bro. Don't be scared of death. Celebrate that. You know what I'm saying? I know that sounds crazy for some of y'all out there, but like for real, like life is great, man. So how many people just you stop, slept just with? Enough. Like over hundred. Sniper out now on all digital platforms. <laughs> I think she looks like a fifteen to twenty man kind of girl. Yeah, I think she's about fifteen to twenty man, you get me? About two free relationships. she said three relationships. You get me? One, two holidays, bruv. The willies pile up, bruv. You do some addition, subtracted. Next thing you're at 20, bruv. You get me? That's how it is. So nigga, back in the- Nigga, are you a mathematician? Are you just, nigga, he just like that. You just know. Oh, he, yeah, he built it. Nah, that's crazy. Let's say I've seen- like, My boy said one, two, hot, one, two holidays. The willies pile up, oot woo. It's how it go. And he not lying though. He not lying. Listen, for, I know he's being completely honest. You know what I'm saying? I know he's saying he's saying a lot right now. But some of the, some of these things, I know some of y'all are like, damn, this nigga kind of spitting though. Like he's he's these fa facts. Like a few things. I had a few things on rotation. For real. Right? What I do? I see one in the morning. Yeah. So like, let's say not in the morning, like twelve o'clock. What a girl. Yeah? She come through. Yeah. Then five. Then she go around five o'clock. I got my next thing. Five o'clock, one would leave around nine, yeah? And then I get my next thing come for around 12. No, you're yeah? actually disgusted. Around 12, yeah? And then in the morning, I'd say like, yo, Baze, I got, I got to go work. Them times I didn't even have a job, bruv, you get me? But I'd say, yo, Baze, I got, to, I got to go work, yeah? I put on my clothes, everything, like I'm going to work, yeah? Huh? Why don't you just say, can you leave? Because I'm not a horrible bastard, bruv. That's, that's <laughs> terrible. How could I just tell them to leave like that? That's mad. Nah, the only time like, you gotta go is if like you're a crazy bitch, bruv. If you're a crazy bitch, you gotta leave my house. I remember one time I see a girl, it was like, we must have beat, fell asleep. Four o'clock in the morning, she woke up, said she want pizza. Cause Can she got to do like normal. Four in the morning, bruv. She hungry, worked up an There's no pizza shops open at that time. The Facts. only people out is crackheads, bruv. So you don't cater to women's needs other than just sexual? No, all the just, time. You gotta cater to a woman's needs. Do you want love? Sniper out now on all digital, digital platforms. platforms <laughs> the only reason I started getting better. Hey, I'm gonna start saying that. Sniper out on all digital platforms. Sniper out on all digital platforms. If it's a dumb question or I feel like it's a dumb question, sniper out on all digital platforms, bro. <laughs> and I'm gonna say it just like him. Sniper out on all digital platforms, bro. Straight like that. I, sniper, sniper on all digital platforms. 
Check out Sniper or Digital Platforms. <laughs> the pussy, yeah, it's because I was fat in school. Fat. Like about 14, 15, I was like 16, 17 stone. I got no pussy, rev. Couldn't even see my willy, it was mad. The maddest thing, you'd never believe this if I told you. I lost the my crazy thing is, time. the crazy that's thing is, I can relate. I'm girlfriend, that's my first. Basically, I can relate to that. Year. I remember being over 300 pounds, man. I remember being over 300 pounds, man, and finally losing all that shit in one summer, bro. The lowest I got, I went from 300 to 163, bro. Way less than my sister, dog. And my sister is a little skinny. At the time, was a little. Well, now she's skinny. She probably weigh less now, but like, bro, I was skinny, bro. I don't. I got skinny. I had to put some more meat on my bones, bro. Facts. Now I'm back up. Now I'm back up in the 200 range. You know what I'm saying? But I'm cool where I'm at. You know what I'm saying? I was so good. I was so like loyal, all of that, yeah. But I swear down, I just be online, bro. I'm just seeing bare different things. I just be seeing big back off fires and all of that. I was like, yo. I need to get some of that, bruv. So I literally, I broke up with her after a year. And then the day after Damn. I broke up with her, I started f***ing some next thing from Hans then. Damn. Nah, yeah, that's, yeah. Why have you got gold teeth? Because my teeth are f***ed up, bruv. And my real teeth, I, yeah, ain't you got, I only got baby teeth. I was raised in the Caribbean, and I didn't go to no dentist or nothing. Mad poor, bruv. I steal people's toys, do bare shit. By the time I come back up here, my teeth was just f***ed. When I got some pee, I was just like, let me get these top ones in gold and then i just thought let me go do these bottom ones in gold yeah no, just yeah but that's the reason it's not taste like girls say it just tastes like metal metal, metal. yeah just metal if i didn't have them right now bruv you'd be like yo my teeth is on some <laughs> fucking nightmare on elm street thing bruv it's <laughs> what's your thoughts on like toxic masculinity <laughs> what the fuck is that big man saying i don't even know what that hyper masculinity thing is bruv but shout out to my lgbtq people bruv you get me men being able to be <laughs> what Hey, nah, he funny for that. Hey, let me rewind that. The nitty ting is, bruv. But shout out to my LGBTQ <laughs> people, bruv. You get me? Hey, shout out to y'all boys. To be shout out to y'all. Like, yeah. That's funny. Just be very self aware. Like, mm. if you were upset, like, what is your outlet? I feel like women say they want a man that's all sensitive and all that stuff, yeah? Mm -hmm. And then when he shows you that, you'll think he's a pussy or. No, do you know what? It's about balance. Mm. Because it's like, don't get me wrong, if my man's like crying too much, like, listen, I want my man to be able to, if he's upset, mm. we get upset, we find out, like, we get a solution, done. Don't keep right. crying about the same solution. So mm. that, that would annoy me. It's just about knowing that you can open up. So let me ask you a question, yeah? You're at a rave, yeah? You're at a rave with your man, yeah? Mm -hmm. Some random guy comes by you, like, six foot five, AJ looking, yeah? He slaps you. Who's your AJ? Yeah? Your man tries to hype up and he's like, bruv, shut your mouth, bruv. Yeah, and then he slapped the shit out of your man. Your man don't do nothing. Then you go home and you're like, Baze, why don't you do anything? And he's like, oh, Baze, I don't want to get hurt. Did it. What would you say to him then? When we have this conversation, it's like, oh, just because man- You're getting stabbed. Just know that. And it's going to be with this right here. <laughs> Straight to the neck. The fuck is you talking about? Soon as, nigga, uh, uh. Soon as you, soon as you turn around. Soon as you turn around. Yeah! Right to, come on now. The cries doesn't make him a That's straight like that. Well, I ain't even about to play. I ain't even gonna play with him. See, when he's behind you, the shit up and he's like, whose pussy is this? Who's pussy? You're gonna be like, it's yours, babes. Yeah, it's so After you just saw a man got slapped out. Yeah, but, like, but the thing is, though, like, men have issues within themselves. Like, a man and a man, like, the toxic masculinity, that's your own issue. Because that's an issue that men need to work on. I can only work on an issue with my man if that makes sense, because okay. I know like the man reacting like that mm. is toxic and he has his own trauma. The so big man thing, more of the story is, man, them don't get slapped in front of your gal, bruv. She'll f*** your best friend. Facts! Facts! No, no, unsay that. No, it's, it's too late. There's a stigma around men showing emotions. No, bruv. Like, I'm you can't saying say that. You have a big platform and you can't say that. It's facts, it's facts, it's facts. No. Do that as well. I, I think it's facts, if you want it's facts, a, it's a facts. Functioning, healthy Listen, man, it's facts. You, you need to be able to cry, you need to be able to open up. Mm. Yeah, yeah, but. I like the way like you that. just like. Big man thing, and I like the earrings. Snap on all these little platforms. I'm not gonna lie, you know, bruv. She's chatting bare shit, so I just zone out for a bit. I like that. But still, I do believe you like bad man, though. Brilling. So like with your social media platform, do you find that you have some sort of responsibility for like what you put out? There's certain men that ask me and certain women that ask me for relationship advice. And to me, it's a simple answer. But then there's some people, they're going through some real shit. So them, them people oh, there, man. I got a responsibility to because I know what it's like. Be through some hard times in it. So like my thing is this, yeah. It's a responsibility in the sense of like, I always think about people's mental health and what they're going through before I ever take the piss out of them, yeah? yeah. But if it's on some like, 
You're my youth role model thing, bruv. Fuck you and your youth, bruv, I don't care. You know what I mean? I ain't yeah. no role model to nobody. In terms of people and helping them, 100%. Because like I said, them people saved my life. Them people got me out of nothing. Bruv, I had no money, universal credit, all of that run out, nothing, yeah? Then literally I'd be like, yo, who needs promotion? Da -da -da -da. Somebody send me a 500 right there. Saved my whole life for the month. I definitely owe them people. Damn. They would never know how much I owe them. Damn. Like, that's, why, that's why I never really ever will ever shit on social media thing. Because like, it's, it's saved my life. Because honestly speaking, if, it, if I didn't have that, I'd definitely be in jail. 100%. Damn, man. Hey, hey. Crazy. Yeah, I love to eat pussy. Yeah. Like, real Yes, sir. Talk it. Though. Yeah, I love to eat pussy. Finally! Someone actually eats pussy. Like, do you know what it is? It's like, if you've liked a woman for a long time, like, if she's like your, like your crush, like, there's women that, like, I've crushed hard on social media, yeah? Facebook, Instagram, all that, then I got with them, and I swear down, as soon as we got together, bruv, as soon as, like, you got to that moment, yeah, I swear down, bruv, man, this parted that like Moses, bruv, face deep, bruv. I'm talking about face deep, I'm talking about, yo. I'm talking about straight in there, bruv. I became an animal. I became a different man. Bruv, there ain't nothing wrong with eating some pussy, bruv. There's nothing wrong with some good, clean naan bread. You get me? Nothing wrong with that. Facts. Yeah? yeah Facts. You put you, it in. Real talk. Facts. Bruv, facing it, tongue f it, suck the You get me? Switch the tongue all the way around it, bruv. You get me? All the juices and all that shit, bruv. It's like a passion fruit. I love that shit. This is the right technique still. It's all right. Give him some ratings there. <laughs> Other than sex, as you have a lot of it, what else do you like to do? I like giving people advice. I like helping people. Yeah. You get me? I love doing music. That's, That's my main thing. Up. Snipe out now on all digital platforms and that. You get yes, me? Yes, sir. But like, I love helping I people. I might have to react like, to that. You get me? See I what's up with that. I fuck with this like, dude. I do like relationship cool. advice. I get people DMing me like, wait, what? He cool. wait, wait, wait. Yeah. You give relationship advice. Yeah, yeah. See, what kind of person is taking relationship advice off this man? Who we'll talk? No, no, no. No, we'll talk. I'm not lying. Like, literally, like a few years ago, some girl DM me. Like, she said that her man was a cross-dresser and she started sending me pictures of him and he was wearing dresses and he was wearing her shoes and that. You get me? And I, I, just, I just told her, like, yo, okay. man's just living his life, expressing himself, innit? Facts. If you're not down with it, you can't do shit. So then me and her linked up, like, a week later and we was... No, this is what I'm saying. That's <coughs> not advice. That's yeah. just, like... <laughs> The dick alive? Hey. I don't know. No, I helped her, bruv. A man won't give him hey. a dick. That's mad. I don't know, bruv. Right, he's so depriving her. No, but he's depriving her, bruv. Like, he's, she's going insane, bruv. A man's wearing her heels and that. That's mad. Right. Do you not want love? Snipe out now on all digital, digital platforms. platforms yeah, yeah. tell it. I want peas, bruv. Yeah? I want money. Peace. That's what I want. You want money. just money? Yeah, the love thing. Money's what so I want. So you don't want love? No, 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 no bruv. Has your heart been broken? Yeah, a few times. A few is that times why you don't want love? Do you feel like you've been burned so many times you're just not on it now? Do you know what it is, yeah? I'm on a leng and gal down thing right now, bruv. I'm not gonna lie. It's just about lenging down the gal then right now, bruv. I just feel like, bruv, this willy's gotta be shared, bruv. I just gotta leng down the gal. That dick is not going anywhere near me. <laughs> you've done it enough. Nah, bruv. I gotta explore the world, bruv. This is London. It's a bigger world, bruv. It's Brazil. Bro, France, Sweden, so Russia, gonna, bear things, bro. You ever gonna settle down? Like, what, when are you gonna be like, right, that's it? A snap out now on all digital platforms, bro. Not telling. Can't tell you. Because he don't even know. He don't know himself. What advice do you give guys to get laid? It's three things, yeah? Mm -hmm. Number one, look presentable. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you get me? Go get okay. yourself a decent haircut. If you're a fat bastard, go gym. Some man can't pull it off, you get me? Yeah, that's number one. Get your appearance down, you get me? You don't okay. want to be scaring off the gallery. That's not yeah? facts. Number two, facts. be confident about your shit. It don't matter if you're broke. It don't matter if like, you're a top waist man. You can make it work. A lot of men that are super waist man, they get gal. You just need a bit of confidence, yeah? And number three, don't overthink the thing. Yeah, a lot of men think that Chatting to a gal is a big thing, like approaching a gal is a big thing. You just got to look at it like this. Don't go in there with no motives. Even trying to go in there to get pussy is a mad thing. Just go in there on some get to know the person thing and everything will fall into place. It's when you try and force it and try and have an objective, try and have a motive, try and have some sort of end goal. You're going to show your card straight away. Gal is going to see through that. See you're trying to get pussy, see you ain't got no confidence and it's gone. Yeah. Just strike up a regular conversation. If you get rejected, <coughs> Rev, there's bare gal out here. Facts. Not that deep. Oh, and that was a hey, that was some that was some good ass advice. That that was some good ass advice, man. 
Yeah. Nah, bro, I don't give a fuck about family. My whole life has just been me and my mum. Damn, you lost me there. You both lost me there. You lost I had a one night stand, bro, in a crack house. They made me. They both got schizophrenia. My mum, my gran Damn. adopted me. That's just me and my mum. And that's all it is. That's all I give a fuck about. Mum was like 83 years old, yeah? And when she passes, that's it, bruv. I'm gonna be on a super mad thing. No, but yeah. No, no, don't do that. But yeah, crazy. when it comes to the family. Does mum want to see like grandkids and stuff? I don't know, man. But like. Have you ever had that conversation, genuinely? Like, does she know how active you are? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. My mum used to meet Bear Gal. My mum used to meet Bear Gal back in the day. Yeah, but has she, has she ever just been like, you know what, like settle down, meet a nice woman? And, like, nah, she'd tell me not to get none of these things pregnant, bruv. Like, she'd be like, don't get none of these things pregnant. You're moving mad. I met my Damn. dad at 23. Yeah, he never knew about me, and I never knew about him. Because it was a one night stand thing, innit? Like, literally, they just met, there was an Elin, they had a one night stand. That must have been the best pussy I had in his life, bruv. Because, like, literally, they made me in it. So, like, after that, it's disappeared, bruv. It's not his fault, though. You That's crazy. That's t- why my dog is the way he is, bruv. Thing when they were selling crazy. drugs in and out of prison and all that stuff. And then he come out of prison. He was in prison for like seven years. Then he come out, and then my grandson on a bus, he said, like, you know, you got a son. And he was like, what? Then he grabbed my granny, threw her against the wall and he, off the bus and he ran down the stairs. Wow. But then they made the connection or whatever and then I met him. But yeah, he's all right, man, he's all right. Damn. So if I'd slept with a hundred men, mm. how would you feel about that? I feel like you need to get some professional help, man. <laughs> come with the same energy that you come with yourself then, innit? Like, no, I'm f- you need to get some professional help, facts. Like, why are you out here going absolutely insane for her? I mean, I, I'm, I mean, facts. I mean, hey, she need the help. You know what I'm saying? I know, I know him too, but it's like, at the same time, it's like, like, the fuck? What the fuck are you saying? Fine. With people's body count. I genuinely don't have uh-uh. an issue with your body count. Why I, we don't, do we, I have to be burning? We don't even, that's why we don't even ask that. Like, we don't even ask those type of questions. It's like OnlyFans. Girl, that do OnlyFans. I'm all for that shit. I love that shit. I think you should do that. But for the wifey, Man can't do that, bruv. Because, like, look at this. Like, look at the only So, why should I make you my husband? That's what I'm saying. No, so, no you ain't got it, though. That's what I'm saying. saying. So, what's acceptable for you? I don't think about girls' body counts. I'll never ask. Facts. I'd rather not okay. know. Facts. I, I'm never going to ask you. I, I don't want to know that shit. Facts. How can you be my wife, my queen, my soulmate? These times, man can see your pussy for four ninety nine a month, bruv. Yeah, but then Netflix is ten pounds, bruv. Yeah, but then Netflix why? is ten pounds. That means my girl's pussy is worth less than Netflix, bruv. That's mad. Do you reckon you ever will just settle with just one woman and not cheat, be with her? Snipe out now on all digital platforms. No, I hate, honestly, I hate you. Listen, nah, Netflix is crazy. $4.99? That's how how much it's going for on on OnlyFans? No, that's... I didn't know that. I've never been on OnlyFans. Like, that. that's insane. That's crazy. No, that's crazy. It's so hard to have a conversation with. So I'm going to take that as a no. Snap and out now on all digital platforms. That's bro. how much they worth. I feel like this is a front. And this is why you got your glasses on. And I think that it's like an insecurity thing in the nicest way. Mm. You have good intentions, but you just choose not to. And it's a shame. And that's why I'm not falling for that bad boy storyline that I could make you change. You're just toxic piece of shit. Big man thing. Cheers to the toxicity in that. Done now. Yeah. No, that's a, really. That's a fuck no, bro. What was the question? That's Wait. Farting and put. Pu- oh hell no. No oh, hell fuck no. no bro. That shit makes my dick soft, bro. Never. Really. Once again, I fart, like. Would you fart is- at me? No. Oh okay. Busting a shit on a mad list like that. No, bro. Like. Really? Get some VI poo, bruv. Spray that shit in the toilet after you're done, bruv. You get me? Like, don't be out here just shitting up the place. Like, but it's normal. It is normal, bruv. But that whole fighting and burping shit, that's the first way to put me the f*** off. Really? Like, I will cheat on you so quick, bruv. Like, literally Damn. so quick. I just feel like that's mad disrespectful. Like, fighting and burping in front of me. Like, what the fuck is this? I, I, mean, not. I say once you get in a relationship with somebody and, you know what I'm saying, once you're deep in, you know, like a good, like y'all been together for a while, you know what I'm saying, at least probably over a year. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah, like then, okay, maybe, you know, you can let one loose here and there, everywhere, every now and then. But, you know what? Let me stop the cap. You know what? Let me stop the cap, man. My girl's done it a few times and I don't mind, man. It ain't bad. She's still bad. <laughs> like, you just got your preference at the end of the day. Yeah, but still, like, fine and buffing, like, it's like, am I your child, man? Really? 
is pathetic, mate. Bruv, a girl cannot fart around me if a stinky Betty, bruv. It's mm. not happening. It's I like, want I want a best friend though. You know nah, what I'm saying? I want and my man's my best friend. Do you know what it is? Yeah, I'll be honest with you. Like once you fart in front of me, you can never try and be sexy. The moment you put on lo- like lingerie in that, I'm just looking at you like, right, look at this stink batty gal, bro. <laughs> For a smelly bum, bro. Oh yeah, sorry. It depends, on it? If, like, if you've got some shit kids, bruv, it's like, no, bruv, you get me? I've had times where, when at a girl's house, one time I was at a girl's house, I held, I held a girl's hand and her son, literally, bruv, he threw a plastic chair at me, bruv. I was like, yo, dickhead. If it's but, a like, kid. You know, I don't give a f***, bruv, he threw a plastic chair at me. But if the kids are nice, then it's a yeah all the way. I, I don't mind. When you get to a certain age, like, you're going to have to expect a girl has kids, bruv, you get me? Yeah. So it's not a problem, unless your kids are dickheads. You can't call kids dickheads. Yeah, you can, bruv. You There's a lot of dickhead youths out there, bruv. Bear them. Yeah, I'm sleep. <coughs> yeah. Yes or no? Some girl, like, you need to give them that cut off for life. Otherwise, they're always going to think it's a thing. And then if I get off a new woman, I never want you ever thinking that you're some competition to her. Like, you're dead, bruv. Like that. You can never be anybody to her. You're nobody to her. You can't just be lingering in the back. You need to know that this is the upgrade, bruv. You ordered Nokia 5110, bruv. This is the iPhone 15. Ain't no, there's no comparison. <laughs> Yeah, you but Nokia's me? was a good phone, though. Yeah, but that's some old shit, bruv. We ain't fucking with that no more. Yeah, I don't fact. mind, because I think, for me, I've never really had a toxic end to relationships. Mm. If it makes but then sense. what about your new guy? Like, you just... No, nah, but it, there's a boundary, do you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm never going to have my man look stupid. I'm not embarrassing my man. I'm, he's not going to... But even his chance to your ex-man is a bit of a violation. No, I... Like, just knowing the fact what? that you're chatting to the next man that had his will in your mouth, it's oh, mad. Yeah. You get me? And so then would you not be happy with that? Hell no. If it's a serious thing, nah, man. You can't be chatting to them, man. Yeah, all the time, bruv. That's standard. Yeah, sucking toes is blessed. Like, once, but man, nah, not so much. No, nah, but I've had girls. You lost me there, bro. Nah, you, you, you out of here. Nah, not toes, bro. That's dead. Toes, that's bro. dead. Yeah, if you've got that's nice, nice feet. If you've yeah, got nice, nice feet. It, like, it's like, it hits you in different places. Like, yeah. you feel tingles. It's like, girl licking your nipples and that. It's like, yo, it's a bit zip. No. My nigga. Sucking toes is crazy. Who the fuck? <laughs> Hey, if you do it, hey, that's you. Go ahead. Who the fuck does that? Though? I don't know. I don't know anybody who Fisty, really be doing that. But it hits the spot. You get me? Yeah, that's nice. And if a girl's got pretty toes as well, it's amazing. Like when you're sucking a girl's toes, it's just woo. <laughs> get me? I, I, I go mad. Like I put my tongue between the nail, baby toe, all of that shit. Yeah. I love that shit. Was there anything you're embarrassed to admit? Nah, not really. No. You know what it is? I've gone through some up shit in it so then you know when you go through some mad shit like you gotta be you gotta be super like open like i've had times when i've been super broke a tin came to my yard you go to the shower you gotta wear shoes to the shower bruv because the, the floor soaked as f- i was living in a mad place there's maggots on the floor like things at your yard to see the maggots on the floor you Ooh. can't say shit bruv it's just... I feel like you're really yeah my brother came from the gutter things like i don't know i've got to live life in it like just because it's a bit shit i'm not gonna get like it's depressing enough in it i gotta find little ways to make myself smile bruv, she thinks she is, bruv. Trisha Goddard in that, bruv. She thinks she's a therapist. Long. What if my ex was after you? If it's over gal, he needs to f*** off. But if he's got a personal problem with me, I'd have to mash him up. First. But if it's over you, I ain't beefing over you, bruv. Why? What if we were together? And I ain't beefing over gal, that's dead. Love? Can't beef over gal. So if earlier he... when I asked you... Yeah, I don't... Unless it's really like my girlfriend, you feel me? I, I can't do it. I can't do it, chief. I can't beef over a girl, you know what I'm saying? I can't. I can't beef over a girl. That, when you gave me your scenario. Like, yeah. So now there's no beef over a girl. No, you shouldn't beef oh, over yeah. a girl. I'd have a problem with him coming to me, not with you. Because I'm not beefing over a girl, but on a man level, if he crosses, like if he's trying to cross that line, I have to mash him up. That's mad. Okay, so what if we were out then, yeah. and I'm your woman, and someone yeah. touches me in the club, what are you doing about it? I'd have to mash him up, because now you're disrespecting me. It's not even about you. You think I'm a pussy, yo, that's why you're doing that. OnlyFans is off the cards then. No, no, I'll link a girl with OnlyFans. It's not going to be no super relationship thing, bruv, because like I said of OnlyFans, the levels escalate. One minute, it's the show and the nipple. You get me? Next thing you know, you're trying to charge man a subscription of £20 for you to suck willy on there, bruv. <laughs> Two years later, now you're trying to show man your whole uterus, bruv. Yeah, giving nah. Giving birth on there. Yeah, nah. Man. Crazy. Now that means as soon as my ute enters the earth, as soon as he comes into the world, he's already a waste man, bruv, because his mum's moving mad. Can't have that. What if I genuinely want to involve other people in our sex life? If it's another girl, cool. If you try to bring them in there, it's a whole other mad thing, man. Why? 
Mm. Now you're just violating me on next level. Now I gotta watch next yeah, man see. push out of you while I'm there yeah, in yeah. the back, just watching like a victim, bro. What is the problem with having a man? <laughs> so man's gonna be drilling you out, and I'm like looking at man's ball bags clapping off your bum cheeks. That's mad. You can take. That's yeah, no, yeah, no, bro. Yeah, no, bro. It's not happening. It could be a girl. We're not doing no no man's man. No, fuck that. You're gonna Tips. give me PTSD. I'm insane. Oh so I've seen an ex. Hey, now PTSD is, is crazy. I'm lit, bro. Now I'm just watching. Mad that nigga going through. He. He and he going through the psyche war. If it's another gal, it's cool. But yeah. the gal has to be on your level. You get me? You can't be bringing no super fat bitch built like a snowman to me, bro. It's dead. I like big things. Yeah, if you're built like a things. snowman, it's, there's there's thick. I like big and curvy. Super big and curvy. You could be 16, 17, 18 stone and curvy. But if you're built like a like a raspberry, it's not happening, bruv. Can't just be out here built like a minion, bruv. What is this? <laughs> nah, nah, minion is cr a minion? A minion. Bye bye. No, because my, that's gonna make my, no, because that's gonna make my dick soft, bruv. If your belly is bigger than your bum, come on now. What? That's some biggest loser shit now, bruv. How's your belly sticking out further than your bum? That's mad. You're built like Jeez. Tyson Fury, bruv. That's oh my mad. God, Tyson Fury. What if I earn more money than you? I, I don't mind that. That's all good of me. Most girl I've ever dated earn way more than me. Way more. I like that shit. That means that you're about sign, you get me? You can elevate me on some next shit and inspire me and motivate me to get on your level. I love that shit. Nice. That's not bad. It's not bad. How do you think you've done on the date? I don't really give a shit. I'm not going to lie, bro. <laughs> hey, he a savage. No, I don't really give it. No, not giving a shit is crazy. You've been sitting here all this time, bro. I don't really yeah, give a I shit. I know that to I do good. You get me? I know that I'm a spice. So, right. regardless how it goes, I don't give a oh, shit, bruv. I'm going to leave it and get some pussy anyway. So, I had a great time. You get me? Crazy. How about you? You have a good time? Crazy. I'm having the right time. Don't know. I like that. Denkashen. You get me? I think it was a great date. You get me? Like, I left the house. I was in a good mood. Came out here. It was a nice day. Had some wine, some good conversation. It was nice. He was honest, so I can't knock him. He was an honest guy, but Facts. that was awful. Like, who talks about sex so much? She was cute. I like her vibe. There was definitely not a second date. If she put on about two, three stone, I would definitely date her again. I think he handled the grilling well. Although, like, I felt I couldn't really grill him. I just was trying to, like, I wanted him to confide in me, you know? Yeah, I no, think I did well, you know? I feel like throughout that whole thing, I got to know her a bit well, you get me? So it was nice. But Fine. we knew, we knew you what he, that's what you wanted him to do though. That's the crazy part. Did good. So the moment he walked in, I thought, I thought, you know what? Let me just ride it out. It surprised me that she was a bit nervous still. She looked a bit rattled, I'm not gonna lie. I think what impressed me the most was his honesty, because I genuinely like an honest man, but however, it didn't actually impress me what was coming out of his mouth. Big man thing, I think she's definitely gonna rate me a 10, bruv. You get me, I'm the main event, mm -hmm. I'm actually not. Mm -hmm. 10, I think some of that crack rubbed off on him. That girl That's definitely crazy. likes bad boys, bruv. I'm That's telling you, crazy. man them, bad man, hit her up, bruv. I'm telling you, she's on that. This is a very generous, like, score that I'm what is it? him. I felt like he was opening up and honest, and I always want an honest man, but he has way too much trauma going on, and I'm not trying to mother him. Like, I just want a partner. So I'm going to give him a three. A three? Whatever, we don't give a, like he said, we don't give a fuck. Man, we want to get something after this anyway. <laughs> hey, listen, man, if you made it to the end of the video, you know what I'm saying? Hey, I had a fantastic time watching this. Love this video, man. Grilling with Costello. Snap out on all digital platforms, man. Listen, if you knew, you already know what to do, baby. We on our way to a hundred souls. Let's go, let's go, let's go. It's been your boy J2 Co. You already know. And I'm out, bruh.